man. It's been a, it's been a year since we've seen you inside the cage. Yep. Uh, where have you been? Recovering, rehab. From an injury? Yeah, my last fight. I, I told my ACL my last fight. So yeah, it's my fight back from there. And yeah, I feel good. Still not 100%, but uh, I'm ready though. Like seven weeks. And that was uh, your first loss since your pro debut. Uh, do you yeah. feel like that, that that knee bothered you a lot? Was it towards the end? Was it towards the beginning of the fight? The beginning. Soon as like I say, the first 30 seconds of the fight, man. If you guys go back and watch that fight, um, we exchanged punches, and I shot him for a takedown. And then as we hit the cage, I guess the doctor said the impact from uh, being here, it, it gave out. And then I, my body, like, so we hit the cage and then I fell to the right. So then I, I thought I was okay and I kept fighting, you know? And then after that, I put him in a choke and, and I turned off the cage and then it gave out on me again. And then from that point on, I was like, okay, fuck it, I just gonna give him my all until I don't have it anymore, you know? Is that your first major injury in your athletic career? Oh, yeah, definitely, something? for sure, yeah. And I know a lot of athletes say that the physical's bad enough with the mental game, too. You want to get back in there. Yeah, yeah. Talk to me about that. Was it that I, I feel like it made me better, man. I'm not going to lie. Like, in, the, in a lot of areas that where I was weak, you know, like some balance, head and hand and eye coordination. So it, it made me better in a lot of ways, which is it's like a gift and a curse, you know? You have uh, another, you have an opportunity to redeem right, yourself. Actually, a curse and a gift. True. Put it like that. You have an opportunity to redeem yourself, get back in the win column right. uh, this weekend. How, how long have you, how much of a training camp have you had for this fight? Was this something that was kind of last second? Have you had a full camp? Um, well, I, from the injury, I've been like consistently training or doing something for my body, you know, so. I've been training for like a year. I'm not, like I could say, you know, like one year, a whole year, just getting ready, you know, for a fight. And then when the doctor was saying it's it's almost there, you know, he was like, I can't clear you if you want to fight. I'm like, yeah, you know, I want to fight. But even then, I, even after this fight, I still have to go back and do more rehab because it's not where it needs to be, you know. How much can you read into a loss like that? Obviously, you're dealing with the injuries. Yeah. Is it tough to even go back and watch it? Man, I watch it all the time yeah. just because it, it showed that I, I didn't rehydrate right after the fight. I, I didn't drink. I didn't, I didn't rehydrate at all, actually. I weighed in at 155, and I came back at, like, 160. So I didn't do no rehydration. And then I fought with a torn ACL. So on top of being dehydrated with a torn ACL, it's like, man, I could, if, I, if I could get through that, imagine if I do everything right, I'll be, able, I'll be good, you know? And your opponent, Craig Campbell, he has six pro fights. He's fought for Ellen Bayo. What are you expecting out of him when you guys step in? I'm not even sure. Though. I'm just going to like just do my thing, you know, and let the fight come to me, take my time, be patient, and, you know, get that win. And I know you don't want to obviously look past your opponent. Is, is the fight against Corey Brown one that you'd like to have back? Oh, definitely. Oh, win? for sure. Yeah. All day. So maybe after, if you go out there, oh, yeah. yeah. All day. All day. Is this a sneak attack kind of move? I mean, like, I feel like. It's a this call out. We really get announced that much at all. Like I think they put oh, it on Instagram. And right. We found out about it today, my man. <laughs> yeah. Okay. Nice. That's good, man. That's, keep me under the radar for now. That's good. <laughs> I mean, when did you know about that? Uh, two weeks, three weeks. Okay. So yeah. not that long either. Right. <laughs> yeah. It was both like two weeks, a uh, two week thing for both, both me and me and the guy. Sneak right in and like, yeah. hey, what's up? I'm here. <laughs> right. Exactly, man. It's been a year, man. I'm ready to just get back in there, and get get my feet wet again, you know. Uh, I love this thing. I love this sport. So you know, this is something I love to do, and I'm ready. You know? I just want to have some have some fun, you know.